Maeda will serve. 13 serving 19. And that time, Nightingale is blocked back. 19-14. That's set a little bit low for Nightingale. Nightingale at 6-3 needs it up higher. Maeda will serve. 14 serving 19. Back up by Norton. And that ball is just put over by Nightingale, one-handed. And Longo elongating herself, trying to get to it. Couldn't quite reach it. What a clever play by Wainoa that time. Just a sophomore now. Uh, she sat at the bench most of last year. She's playing behind an All-American in Lauren Van Orden, who was, by the way, a San Diego State transfer who left after two years at San Diego State. But uh, Moynoa getting her chance now, and that was a brilliant play she just made there on a, a very tightly passed ball. Croson Uyato kind of pushing it right into the double block that time. Was Hartong. 11 blocks to two for UCLA. And she was called for the double hit. More troubles, 21-14, UCLA. Time now for the Fujitsu air conditioning cool play of the match. Comes in the first set, and it's a brilliant side bump set by Iwiato, followed by a crushing blow out of the back row behind the premier line by Jane Croson. That was really the cool play of the match. Rachel Kidder serving for UCLA Croson, and Uyato has a quick shoulder turn, and the dump shot works. So it's 21 to 15 UCLA here in the third. Match is tied at one set apiece. Croson to serve. About dug up by Budorovic and hit down again by Tabby Love. Yeah, Tabby Love, the way she's jumping right now with her six foot five inch frame and long reach, it really doesn't matter if the block is well formed or not. She just goes over and down. There you see the hitting percentage. She's usually hitting around 300. Hawaii at 0.69 here in the third set. Todorovic serving. And stuck up by Maeda. Croson. Longo gets it across. Here's UCLA. Happy love. Off the block, but there is Maeda. Uyato short set. The ball is hit over by Hagens. And Hagens will celebrate that. Because unable to lift the ball or... Pop it up was Reeves. Twenty-two, sixteen, UCLA leading. Lele Pale back in to serve for Hawaii. Back up by Reeves, Moinoa in the air, and Tabby Love right by Uyato and, and uh, Burster. Twenty-three, sixteen. UCLA closing in on this third set. Forster pushes it long, and now it is set point. Twenty-four to sixteen. UCLA has dominated from the start of the second set. Good idea by Iwiato, but it's not a very clean connection at all. Moinoa serves. Back up by Croson, Uyato. Hartung goes cross court, and that's good. That's a point for Hawaii, 24 17, UCLA. Hawaii having to do it the hard way. See Uyato having to run behind the three meter line to set the ball. It gives UCLA a chance to form the defense. They know where the ball is going to go, so Hartung did it the hard way. Uyato serving. Back up by Todorovic, and again. It is Tabby Love. That'll do it for the third set. UCLA wins it 25 to 17. And now they take a two set to one lead in this match with Hawaii. Hawaii winning the first set an extra play 30 to 28. And ever since it has been a domination by UCLA, 25-16, 25-17. Let's take a look at the Jack in the Box Jack Fest.
See you again next year. Hawaii and UCLA have faced each other at least once in every season since Hawaii's debut in the sport in 1974. And actually, in one year, they played each other six times. Whoa. Those are the good old days. Well, that's a rivalry, and that's how it's established. That's why so many voters on the, the poll, uh, in the, um, the little online poll we've got going on, look forward to having UCLA play Hawaii more than any other team. So we begin the fourth set. UCLA wins this set. They win the match. Hawaii's got to take it to the limit. And UCLA has just dominated them in the last two sets, winning 25 to 16 and 25 to 17. Reeves, Kelly Reeves will start things off for UCLA. She will serve. Leeds, blue and blue and gold, was actually born at the UCLA hospital. Her mom played for UCLA, was a three-time All-American, was an Olympian. She does a little report every week called the Reeves Report. She wants to get into television. And now they change it, and serving will be Hawaii. So Reeves, kind of befuddled by everything, comes into the back row. Serving will be Uiato to start the fourth set. Crowd quiet. Dug up by Todorovic. Moinoa. And that ball hit over and down by Nightingale. Hawaii's back to the original lineup, how they started the night, how they won set number one. They've got Castle on the left and Hartong playing on the right opposite Uiato. Serving was Kidder. Back set to Croson, and she is blocked straight down. Tabby Love was part of that block. Also Nightingale. And it's 2 nothing. The blocking differential continues to mount. Let's see if Uyata goes out to Moinoa, a smaller blocker. Ball hit over by Croson. That'll be returned. Good block that time by Vorster and Croson on Love. She comes back again with the tip shot, and that goes down. 3 nothing UCLA in the fourth set. And Hawaii really now. So the line for Tabby Love, pretty impressive. 18 kills, hit 351. She's got a couple of assists. Kidder to serve. Dug up by Longo, overpass, and the ball is put down by uh, uh, Tabby Love. That could be her 20th kill. That is, uh, I think it is, 20th kill in 40 swings. Tartan. That's stuck up by Reeves, Moinoa. And that time, Hawaii was right there. And they're able to handle that, went into the antenna. Love did a real mature thing just then. She told the sophomore Moinoa, don't worry about it. I know that set was a little close. I got to do a better job of getting it over. It's a very mature action there, I thought, reaction by Tabby Love with her young setter. So Croson will serve for Hawaii, one serving four. That big toss gets it in, dug up by Todorovic. There's a Tabby Love. That double block for Hawaii is very, very porous when it comes to Love. That time, it was... Hawaii's... Forster, Forster was there with uh, Harta. Yeah, Hawaii's not the only block this year that will struggle with Tabby Love, trust me. Todorovic serving in the air by Castle, chased down by Longo. Croson gets it across. Moinoa, no look, dump shot. That'll be returned. There's Hartung, dug up by Kidder. And the ball goes over by Love. And either Love didn't see it or she slipped or something, but she couldn't handle it. I think she thought that Moinoa was going to go over and set the ball. So she was backing off to attack. And all of a sudden, the last second, Moinoa did not follow through. And Love had to lunge at it. Longo will serve for Hawaii here 
in the fourth set. Dug up by Reeves, Moinoa, and the ball hit down by Aquino. Everything that UCLA has tried or is trying is working. It probably helps too that Michael Seeley knows a lot of the Hawaii players and their tendencies having coached here for so many years. Hard time. Blocked again. Tabby Love and Aquino. And it's seven to two already in the fourth. You know, Hartong tried to do the right thing. She tried to go down the line, but Love just too big, too strong. Ball put over by Adolfo. Coming down the middle is Kidder. Kidder's able to put that ball straight down in front of the Hawaii block. Hawaii is getting blitzed here in the fourth set. They trail eight to two. Now you see the story, Hawaii winning an extra play, 30 to 28, but since that time, 25, 16, 25, 17, and here in the fourth, eight to two, it has been all UCLA. You know, it really isn't so much Hawaii playing poorly as it is UCLA playing well. They've got that giant block up front. They're playing some pretty darn good defense behind that block. They're hitting for such a great hitting percentage on offense. So it's a good combination of offense and defense. Look at that. Differential in blocks 13 to 2 for UCLA. So uh, Hawaii's doing all they can, but they're up against a very, very good volleyball team. Moinoa to serve for UCLA. Croson, Boyato, Castle. Solo block that time by Kelly Reeves. So Oyato does the right thing. She goes out to the Hope that her outside hitter will go against the smallest blocker, Reeves. Reeves is, Reeves is about six feet tall. And uh, even that, Hawaii can't get by. Moinoa continues to serve. Castle Uyato. Ball is hit over that time by Hartung. And that ricochets off Moinoa. That's a point for Hawaii. It's only the third point in this fourth set. And Hartung. Well, sir. With kill number 19 is Harton. There's Reeves, Moinoa. Love again. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Love you know. again. 21 kills now. 22. Make that 22. It's hard. It's, we're losing track here, it's actually. It's amazing. It's yeah. hard to tally them fast enough. There is Adolfo. Adolfo went down the line, and she will get a point, and it's now 10 to 4. Now, that was a solid, smooth connection between Uyato and Adolfo. Here's Castle to serve now for Hawaii. Ashley Castle. Actually, it was Stobrin that was in there, that, that connection with Adolfo. Oh, it was, yes. Hawaii is used. Many players, many. Back up by Todorovic. Outside to Love. Longo is there. The ball in the air by Todorovic. They go to Kidder. Krosen. Krosen went down the line and put it in the corner. That gets the attention of Coach Mike Seeley. Hawaii showing some life the last few plays. Good step out by Adolfo. Crossing with just a little step close attack down the line. Castle serves. That ball put over right hand at that time by Lowe. And right back comes Hawaii. Adolfo. And it's 10 6. Hawaii closes to within four. So some life. Another good connection between Stauber and Adolfo. 